New York Governor Andrew Cuomo, in an epic self-defense of his allegedly inappropriate and criminally illegal touching and more of several women. We first heard from his attorney holding her own press conference for about 30 minutes, and then we waited for a few minutes, and then the governor. And while we knew we would hear from him, we did not anticipate the crescendo of his remarks. First, he went after the allegations with these women. One by one by one, not all 11, but certainly nearly half, he talked about the moments and the things that those women say that they had experienced because he touched them. He said he didn't mean it. Because he said things, he made them uncomfortable. He asked for kisses and hugs. He didn't mean it. All of that leading up to his political enemies who he thinks he is now facing. Although the law plays a huge part in all of this, the attorney general did quite the investigation and made those findings known last week. But for the governor today, he took on the political fight that he said he would be able to wage because he has special gifts in that area because he's from New York. He was ready to fight. But he says he's also ready to serve. And the best thing for the people of New York, crescendo is for him to step aside. And then he says his resignation will take effect in 14 days. And then the soliloquy, the swan song, made it through the pandemic, worst of times, had to do it without help, that whole thing. He thanked New Yorkers for giving him an opportunity to serve. 